Enjoy it. All right, so as you can see, I have the pre-cut pieces ready to go. And I make sure that all of them are lined up down at the base on the starting point. So we're going to reference this and call it a nice starting point here. We're going to look around the back sides, make sure we're straight all the way through and through. Now remember, it's a personal preference if you want the fuzzy side out or if you want the hard hook side out. I like it because it doesn't collect as much dust. So there we go. We have a nice base and reference point. So as you can see, it easily slides right up and the cables, for the most part, line themselves up. And you'll see as we go along here, we're ready for another piece of Velcro. You want to make sure that your inter intervals are even when you place your final deal of Velcro. So I like to make the intervals the same length as the Velcro, as the bundle, in this case. So we can go up here. I straighten it up just a smidgen up at the top. Put another piece loosely, not as tight as this bottom one. And I kind of line up my cables here. It's not a bad idea to pull a little bit of tension on these cables going up too. It keeps them straight, keeps the slack out of them. So I can slide this up a little bit at a time, inch at a time. Now dressing should go fairly quickly. Dressing up is not always not an easy, as easy of a task as dressing down because the gravity helps keep the cables loose and free uh, free movement of untwisting these if they get if they get snagged. Now you can see here, I can just keep moving these two up here and add into, add one new one to the base. That's the technique I use for dressing up.